Hello everyone, this is Ian Lamont, author of Google Drive and Google Docs in 30 minutes. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add a logo to your Google Docs header. And uh, I'm also going to show you how to get rid of one. But this is really useful if you're creating, let's say, in this case, a pricing sheet, or maybe you're creating an official letter from your company or your business or your special project, and you want to put your own logo into there. You just don't want to have plain text there. And this is how to do it. So right here, we have this company document and it's basically uh, a pricing sheet. And I have my old corporate logo up here. But uh, the issue is, is that I don't want to have my address or telephone number here because I'm going to put that in the signature of the letter. And this is kind of an old fashioned logo and I want to replace it. So the first thing I'm going to do is delete the current one. And then I'm going to show you how to import a new one. So uh, to get access to the header of a Google Docs document, all you do is just click in the top and it will show up. And right here, right away, you can see that this image, which I created in another program, is already uh, in there and it's highlighted. So to delete it, all you do is just press the delete button on your keyboard. It's gone. Okay, now you have a blank header up here. And this is what it looks like without a logo, uh, without any header information. But I want to put a new logo in there. So this is what you do. Once again, click on the top and instantly you'll be able to access the uh, the header area. The other way to do that, by the way, if you can't get that to work, click out of that, go to insert header, and the same thing will show up. Okay, now I need to put in my image. Go to insert image, and this little pop-up will appear. And by the way, this is the same in Windows or Mac OS. And what you have to do is you have to go to your Finder in Mac OS or go to the, uh, the, file, the file organizer in Windows and basically drag and drop it in there. So here is my new logo. I'm just going to drag it right in there. It will upload it. And Note that it should be the proper size for, uh, for what you're doing here. I mean, this is only 300 pixels wide and it actually fits pretty well. Uh, but in some cases, you may want to um, get a bigger one or even a smaller one in there. So this is, the, this is the new logo for the guidebook series that I write. And you'll notice there's no other extra information there. If I want to change the positioning of it, so right now it's flush right. And you can see that this uh, right align is already kind of selected. If I wanted to put that in the center, the logo in the center, all I need to do is just click the center button. And there it is. It's right in the center. You can also do things like resize it. So just click on the image and then make it a little smaller. Okay, that looks pretty cool. So. That's basically how you add a logo to your Google Docs document. And if this was a multi-page document, uh, let's say this was 10 pages long, this logo would appear in every single one. If I select this button, different first page header and footer, that means the first page would be treated differently. That and maybe it it only has the, the logo on the first page or it doesn't have any logo on the first page. But you can experiment with this and see how it works for you. For more advice on how to get the most out of Google Docs, check out my book, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. Thank you so much for watching.